Let's make one more tutorial in Autodesk Fusion. In this video, you'll learn how to use the extrude and the intersect extrude. So open the Fusion and let's go. The first step to create this part, we'll select the front plane and make this sketch. Here will be the midpoint. So the first thing that we make, we create this arc here with six millimeters of radius, create a line here and another arc here with 35 millimeters of radius and another arc here with 90 millimeters of radius. So we'll open the fusion, go to create a sketch, select the front plane, go to create and select the center point arc, click here in the midpoint. The radius here is six millimeters of radius, make an arc here. Go to constraint, select horizontal vertical, select this point and the midpoint here, this point and the midpoint. Now select the line, click here in this point, make a line here, and make an arc here and another arc. To create this arc with line, hold the left button of the mouse and make the arc, okay? We make these two arc here, they are tangent. Now go to sketch dimension. The distance between the center of this arc and the midpoint is 86 millimeters by 40 millimeters. So the distance here, 86 millimeters. And the distance here is 40 millimeters. Move this here a little bit. Okay. Go to sketch dimension. The radius here, 35 millimeters. 35 millimeters here. And the radius here is 90 millimeters of radius. Okay. We made this. Now we needed to create an arc here with 15 millimeters of radius and another arc here with 90 millimeters of radius. And the center of this arc is constant with this one and the distance between the both is 24 millimeters okay so select the line here make another arc here and create another arc here okay go to constant select equal select this arc and this one go to sketch dimension the radius here 15 millimeters the distance between these two arc here is 24 millimeters. Let me move this a little bit here. Go to constraint, select horizontal vertical, select this point and this point here. Okay, we made this. Now we needed to create a line here and an arc here. And this arc has a hundred millimeters and it is tangent with this line and tangent with this arc. Okay. So select line, click here in this point, make a line here and make an arc here. Tangent and coincident here. Go to constraint, select the tangent, select this arc and this one. Go to sketch dimension. The radius here is a hundred millimeters. And this arc is tangent with this line. Okay. Now, we will create this two hole here. The diameter of the circle is 9.5 millimeters of diameter. So select the circle, click here in this point, 9.5. Create another circle here, equal. Okay. Now we needed to create this slot and the distance between the centers is 35 millimeters and the distance here, the diameter is five millimeters, okay? So go to create, select the slot, center to center slot, click here, 35 millimeters here and five millimeters here. Go to sketch dimension, you need to put this dimension again, 35 millimeters. And we made this. Okay. 
now finish the sketch we need to extrude this 24 millimeters okay so go to extrude select this profile the direction symmetric measurement only length the distance here 24 millimeters operation new body press ok we made this ok now we'll select the top plane and make this face here or the top face sorry and make this sketch so let's create this go to create a sketch select this face here go to create select the project included project the selection filter select the body select this body here press ok sorry hide the body one we made this now we'll create a line here with 50 millimeters 59 millimeters sorry and create an arc here make the same here in this side and the distance between these two line here is 8 millimeters okay so select line make a line here with 59 millimeters and create an arc here make the same here and line here and then arc here okay go to constraints horizontal vertical select this point and this point here this point and this point here go to sketch dimension the distance between these two line here eight millimeters and the distance between this line and the midpoint is four millimeters okay and the radius here of this arc is 20 millimeters of radius 20 millimeters of radius select the constraint select the equal okay now just to check the distance here 50 millimeters between this point here and this point okay now we needed to create this cut here a line here with 27 millimeters and the line here with 8 millimeters and close here okay so select line make a line here with 27 millimeters a line here with 8 millimeters and another line here go to constraints and select horizontal vertical select this point and this point here we made this okay we have this profile here so finish the sketch now show the body one and go to extract and the all operation select intersect the profile select this profile here and the direction one side and the extended type select the all and flip the direction here operation intersect and press ok we made this okay now we will add a fillet here in the edges in the outside edge the fillet is two millimeters and in this lot the fillet is one millimeter okay so go to fillet select this edge here this one in the other side here Select the fillet here. The fillet here will be two millimeters. Okay. And add selection set. Select the slot here. The fillet here is one millimeter. We made this. Now press letter A in the keyboard. Select the faces. Select the point here, glossy. And here we finish our exercise. So thanks for watching. Subscribe my channel for more. And see you in the next video. Bye-bye.